Well, to, I mean, to be honest, Chris, I'm used to them being a little smaller. <laughs> so, okay. I mean, just by the side of it, it's kind of large. Why be hungry? Hello, YouTube addicts. My name is Chris. And I'm Steve. And this is Why, Why Be, be hungry? hungry. Today on the show, we were, uh, we had a taste for some chicken. We did. And we decided to go to Popeyes. Popeyes! Louisiana fast. So, what we decided to get today is uh, chicken tenders. Mm -hmm. um, but not just any normal chicken tenders. No, not just any normal ones. We're going for the spicy three-piece combo. Ooh, and the combo comes with, well, a side that we chose. We chose it. And we chose mac and cheese. Oh. Uh, it's a classic. Here is your mac and cheese. Thank you. Nice and little And my tub. mac and cheese. We got some forks. They did. Forks in the house. We actually got three of them. Oh, wow. Just in case something happens to one of them. That was a great idea. In fact, they're sporks. Guess what else we got, Steve? What? Napkins. Yeah. Hey. Before we dig in, let's go in for a close up. Oh. Oh. Looks like pretty standard mac and cheese. It's got the noodles of a macaroni variety. Yeah. And the cheddar cheese sauce. Mwah. Should we do a patented first bite? Yeah, let's get up in there. Oh. Ooh. This is very solid macaroni and cheese. Mm -hmm. Right, it's not liquid, it's not gaseous, it's very solid. Now, I always had a question, why don't they call it Cheesy Mac? Because it's cheesy and macaroni. And easy is in the word cheesy. So, I think it's time to move on to the main entree. Yes, I am warmed up and ready to go for this one. The spicy chicken tenders. Mm -hmm. I believe we have not one, not two, but three, count them three, to digest. What an even number for two people. Yeah. <laughs> it comes in this nice little box. Wow. Popeye's Louisiana Kitchen. Ooh. I can smell Louisiana from here. Yeah, me too. And we are not close to there. They offered us a sauce to go with these tenders, and Steve shouted, Bold barbecue, barbecue. sauce. Bold barbecue sauce. It's for the bold. Here you are. Thank you. Do you? Oh, I um, I'll just use my napkin. I think. You got a napkin? Okay. All right. Got it. Dang. Mm. My first couple bites were like only breading. Oh. Like, where's the chicken, ma'am? I mean. The breading is good though, Steve. Oh. Don't you like breading? I mean, it's okay. I mean, I was hoping to just get lots of chunky chunks of chicken. We have slightly different tastes. I'm one of those people who likes a little chicken with my breading, if you know what I mean. Uh-huh, okay. I'm gonna open up some of this barbecue sauce. Oh, go wild, man. <sighs> Cause I'm bold. You are, but I'm bold in a different way. I prefer my chicken naked like this. You do like naked things. Sauce helps. Is it bold? You sure you don't want some of this bold sauce? I think I'm good. Okay. Oh. Oh. Wow, this is kind of... <laughs> not that they only... I mean, they had... Like I said, Chris, they had a lot of breading on those first pieces that I had. And now it's like falling all off on me. Like it's shedding or something. If I wanted that to happen, I'd go home and sit underneath my dog's stomach. You seem a bit surprised by the way chicken tenders work. Is this not how you're used to eating chicken tenders? No, to, I mean, to be honest, Chris, I'm used to them being a little smaller. <laughs> you know, you get it like McDonald's or something, you get those okay. you get those things. This is totally different. You mean on the kid's menu? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, you, so you're disappointed it's not like kid's menu chicken nuggets? Yes. Yeah, exactly. Okay. You guys understand, right? Uh, should we split this? Habsies? If you can figure out how to split that in half, yes. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, it's kind of hard. 
Once again, it's falling all over me. If this was look in an at oval... That. Look at that image. Doesn't that just scream chicken? You know what screams chicken? An, um, an oval-shaped piece of chicken with breading on it that doesn't fall off. Do we have a vacuum cleaner in here? It's just getting all over the place. It's not what I expected when I opened up that box. I mean, well, I think it's about time for our final thoughts. Okay, okay. To wrap up, we had a combo that included the spicy chicken tenders and a side of mac and cheese. We started with the mac and cheese. I was a big fan of the mac and cheese. I would give that mac and cheese a solid 9 out of 10. There you go. Yeah. 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 Personally, I'm going to not really differ with you at all there. I'm going to... Maybe put it at a 8.7 out of 10, just okay. because I, I really wanted more of it. And then after that, we had our spicy chicken tenders. Perfect amount of spicy. It was one of those things where it earned its name because it was spicy, but it wasn't too spicy. Um, I loved the breading. The breading had a great taste, had a great texture. Um, and yeah, I with or without sauce, you know, I thought it, had, it worked either way. I would give it also a solid uh, 8.3 out of 10. Yeah, I um, it was good. I I like the mac and cheese a little better actually, but very very solid chicken. Uh, for a lot of reasons, I'm gonna have to disagree with you there. Um, first of all, it wasn't nugget form. Okay, that really was not okay with me. They weren't called nuggets, but okay, I mean chicken okay, tender, same okay, thing. Okay. If they were in that nugget form, like a circle. Um, It'd be a lot higher in my book. Secondly, it's made a mess all over my shorts, which you can't see right now, but believe me, like, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna have to change when I go home and, like, get into my onesies or something, which I normally don't do until later. So this is throwing my whole day off. The only thing that really saved this chicken for me was the bold BBQ sauce. It was good. Once again, it's in this little tub, so, I mean, need more of that, too, just like mac and cheese. So I'm gonna have to put my rating, Chris, at about a... Five out of ten. Mm. Very, very mediocre. Okay. Comment. What do you think of Louisiana chicken? Is it okay that it's not a nugget form? Is it a problem? I know because let's, I want to know. I think I have some some followers to back yeah, me up on this. Let's hear what you guys think. Um, subscribe to our channel. We release new videos every Wednesday. Mm. Um, there's more chicken to try. There's there's a lot more to try in general. So much to try. Um, but we can't do it without your support. So hey, get that subscription count up. And until next time, we shall continue answering the question, why, why be, be hungry? hungry?